Welcome to a very special Us Gold Cragadon Christmas podcast. Today, you'll hear facts about Christmas around the world and some fun Christmas jokes. Enjoy! Hello everyone and welcome to Christmas Around the World with Madison and today I'm going to talk about Christmas in the USA so let's go. The United States of America has many different traditions and ways that people celebrate Christmas because of its multicultural nature, many customs similar to ones in the UK, France, Italy, the Netherlands, Poland and Mexico. The traditional meal for Western European families is turkey or ham with cranberry sauce. Families from Eastern European origins favour turkey with trimmings, kielbasa, Polish sausage, cabbage dishes and soup. Some Italian families prefer lasagna. Some Americans use popcorn threaded on string to help decorate their Christmas trees. Making gingerbread houses is also popular to make and eat at Christmas. Eggnog is a traditional Christmas drink in the USA. Americans also send out Christmas cards like carol singing and there's the unusual custom of the Christmas pickle. Welcome to a Christmas special. Today we will be learning about Norway and their Christmas traditions. How do Norway celebrate Christmas? Usually on December 24th, Christmas Eve, most Norwegians gather with friends and family to eat a traditional meal and then open presents. Sometimes Father Christmas will even pay them a visit. What do they eat for Christmas dinner? The most popular dishes are pork rib and lamb or mutton rib. They also eat traditional Scandinavian food. What is Hide Your Brooms? Hide Your Brooms is on Christmas Eve and it's said that the day before Christmas people across Norway should hide their brooms to protect against evil spirits and witches. Thank you for listening. Welcome to the Facts on Argentina Christmas edition with Alfie and Isabel. Argentines celebrate Christmas on the 24th more often than 25th. It's common to stay up until midnight, light up fireworks, toast with champagne at midnight and play holiday music. If you're seeking a quiet holiday season, Argentina is the perfect place for you. Many people enjoy a seaside Christmas. In Argentina, shooting off fireworks at midnight on Christmas Eve is a Christmas tradition. I guess that one, that's one of the luxuries of a warm climate. In addition to fireworks, globos or paper lanterns containing small candles are also lit at this time. In Argentina, the main language is spoken in Spanish, still called Castellano by Argentinas, so happy slash Merry Christmas is Feliz Navidad. In Argentina, people watch fireworks from their from the rooftop. Christmas is a holiday celebrated both with friends and family during lunch and dinner meals. Argentines spend the 24th and 25th cooking and laughing with family. Oftentimes there is a big asado or barbecue cook out to enjoy the weather and time together. Most Argentinians are Catholics and attending midnight mass on December 24th is an important part of celebrating the holiday. The, ma- the main Christmas meal is enjoyed on Christmas Eve, often late at night. Roast turkey, roast pork or goat is popular, as, it, as is salad and a selection of festive breads and cakes. Pandals, sweet br- slash sweet bread in Argentina is a sort of panettone from Italy that Argentinians love. They eat it for breakfast or a snack with coffee and milk. The best panettone comes from the local bakery, even though panettone originated outside Argentina, they have created their own pan dulce recipe to enjoy during Christmas in Argentina. Christmas in Argentina usually includes a meat-based meal such as pork or turkey. The most beloved Christmas meal in Argentina is vital phone. Um, it, it's an Italian meal made of slices of veal and topped with a, tun- a tuna and anchovy sauce. People only eat it around Christmas so they look forward to it all year round. Feliz Navidad, Navidad uh, and Feliz, Feliz Ano Nuevo. Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year.
Hello and welcome to Swedish Christmas Traditions by Anea. In Sweden they celebrate Christmas on the 24th. This is a part of Nordic culture. And on the 13th of December they celebrate something called Saint Lucia or Lucy Day. This is a tradition where young girls will get elected in schools to be Lucia. In churches and houses across Sweden, candles are lit every Sunday until Christmas. And how you would watch something like The Grinch, a special channel on Disney, is Donald Duck, which is commonly watched around Christmas time. Another tradition in Sweden is Gavel Goat. This is a massive goat that is generally displayed in Slottstork and is made out of straw and is put up on the first day of Advent. How you say Merry Christmas in Sweden is Good Jo och en god nittar. Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. How do Italians celebrate Christmas by Celeste? First, you prepare for a whole month of festivities by one, start feasting on Christmas Eve, two, share your Christmas spirit with Zampognari, bagpipe playing, look out for nativity scenes, wear red underwear on New Year's Eve, unusual, I know, and more presents from La Befana, a witch who brings good children treats on the morning of January the 6th. At what is thought as a light dinner on Christmas Eve, Christmas Day is all about feasting. Italians cook a large lunch called a sarone of roasted meat, pasta in broth, grilled vegetables and traditional Christmas cakes for groups of friends and relatives. I hope you like my podcast on how Italians celebrate Christmas. Christmas in Qatar. Christmas Christmas in Qatar is celebrated with utmost bliss and numerous events. Tourists can see the Christmas trees from a foyer of hotels with several celebrations. With a tree lighting ceremony, markets filled with decor items, chocolate and Santa cups to boost the festive mood. Symbols and decorations like Christmas tree, candy canes, gifts like lights and the star are one of the many things that come to mind. These are things that make the festive season more delightful. Decorating a home and exchanging gifts make the holiday complete. Special decorations start a week from Christmas till New Year Eve in Qatar, making a aura positive and vibrant. Most hotels and restaurants offer special Christmas Eve dinners which include traditional dishes like turkey. It's not just dinner, the residents and tourists can enjoy a special brunch and lunch as well. Very often, most homes cook their own special Christmas food and have a small gathering. Special Christmas, then goodness, and a few special items to make the stuffing for the turkey at some of the supermarkets in Guatemala. Christmas in Brazil. Welcome to Anya and Ava's Christmas in Brazil podcast. Brazil is highly influenced by Portuguese culture and tradition and this can also be seen in Christmas tradition. In Brazil, Christmas is known as Dia de Festas. It is celebrated on 25th December every year. Since 54% of the population is Catholic, many Brazilians attend midnight mass, exchange gifts and celebrate with large family gatherings the night before Christmas. Many Brazilian Christmas traditions come from Portugal as Portugal ruled Brazil for many years. Nativity scenes known as Presepio are very popular. They are set up in churches and homes all through December. Many Christmas customs are similar to ones in USA or UK, even though it's summer and very hot at Christmas time in Brazil. Many people like to go to the beach. Sometimes children leave a sock near a window. If Papa Noel finds your sock, he'll exchange it for a present. Thank you for listening. Merry Christmas. Here are some Christmas jokes. Why is the Grinch's home called Mount Crumpet? Because he named it 
after his first breakfast there, which was a crumpet. What do snowmen eat for breakfast? Ice Krispies. What is it called when a snowman has a temper tantrum? A meltdown. What do you get if you get a duck in a Christmas cracker? A Christmas quacker. What is a Christmas tree favourite candy? Ornaments. What kind of music do elves listen to? Rap. Who is Santa's favourite singer? Elvis Presley. What was Santa's favourite subject in school? Chemistry. How can Santa deliver presents during a thunderstorm? His sleigh is flown by a reindeer. What does Santa get when he goes down the chimney? Claustrophobic. What do snowmen eat for breakfast? Frosties. What do you get when you cross a snowman and a vampire? Frostbite. What do you call Santa when he stops moving? Santa paws. What do polar bears eat for lunch? Icebergs. What do you call an elf that runs away from the North Pole? A rebel without a claws. What reindeer game do reindeers play at a sleepover? Truth or dear? What happens if you eat Christmas decorations? You get tinselitis. The old hand and off.